Okay, let me, yes. let me bring this thing back for a second. T talk to how did you get, you know, so many people who uh, are part of this generation, they might not know you from Cooley High, uh, Car Wash, Saturday Night Live, The Jeffersons, and I can keep naming them. They know you from right. Martin. They, 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 that, that, that was, the, it, it feels like that was the right. reintroduction. Yeah. If you will. How, how did you get uh, that part on Martin? <laughs> <laughs> so Martin yes. made you yes. audition. Who, who was in your audition? Who was sitting at the other uh, side of the uh, table um, watching um, you? Bentley Kyle Evans. Brilliant man, brilliant uh -huh. producer, writer. And Martin and some other, I don't remember. Who else? I think Martin's manager. His name I forget now. Uh, but yeah, um, artist, you know, and. Uh... So let me get this straight. Because Martin grew up to you, just like I did. You telling me that Negro said, look, Garrett, I understand that you've been doing your thing long before I was born. But, but I need I you to no audition. with that because there were other guys too. Remember the guy who played. Um, Bookman and uh, um, sure. Uh, what's yeah, his name? Yeah. Johnny. Johnny. Yeah, he, uh, he was also up for the court too. So hey, I understand that. They were so so Bookman from Good Times was up for the for your. Well, part. it was not part of that, but at that time it was my part. He and I auditioned because I remember he told me later on that he auditioned for. Wow. Okay. See, I have um, no problem with like I said, not, I go back, I talk about John Connery. Did I talk about talking John Connery? No, no. You you oh, you, 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 you told, right. told no, me about John the John Connery had the audition for Godfather. Did you know that? No, no, no. Sean Connery well, Sean, no, the I Godfather. Marlon Brando rather. Had the yeah. Marlon Brand, Marlon yes. Yep. So, if I got a, once I knew that, okay. I said, hey, he said, Oscar went, who was an Oscar yeah, winner who is. definitely make money and then filming is, is in. And they said, this motherfucker audition. I said, well, get off your high horse, Gary, you know. Okay. Well, while while you, your career is reviving, with Martin, because that's where so many people came to know and love you and, and, and that character you played. You get shot on the yeah. streets in Los Angeles. How the hell that happened? Because I got to believe anybody who is from our community was watching Martin and see you walking down the street. They know exactly who the hell well, you are. Well, this person, um, I'm walking down the street. I'm walking down the street, Wall Street. Two people come in towards me, they pass me, but I don't realize they didn't turn around. The guy grabs me, right? Um, and there's a little girl with him. And um, look, I'm five, at that time I'm five foot six, didn't weigh much. When I turn around, I saw a guy that was five, nine, five, ten, he must weigh about 190 pounds. Um, but when he grabbed me, he misinterpreted what I would do. So what I did, I guess it really embarrassed him a little bit. Um, Cause across the street there had been people across the street who had been saying, hey Stan, hey Stan, hey Stan, hey Stan. But this guy um, was one of those. He was uh, he was gonna rob me, I think. So I wore this leather um, jacket with uh, Af Africa, the map of Africa on the back. I think he wanted that. When I turn around, though, he has a gun pointing at me, and that's when I stop and I said, hey, "Hold on, hold on." He shoots me in the arm, goes to my arm into my uh, intestines. Um, it messed up my uh, intestines that I had to have a colostomy for like five, six, seven months. And uh, it led to me being in the hospital through 10 major operations um, for like three months. Damn. You know, and I was in the coma for like 
two to three days. Yeah. Hold, hold on, you you were shot one, one time. Bullet that. It, it was one bullet went then through it went your through arm. My, from my arm, it went through my. I tell that problem with my elbow. It went through my arm, hit my uh, intestine, and it ricocheted. So it ricocheted to my body. Thank God, it didn't ricochet into my heart. Have you heard? Of that? I've heard that too. Uh huh. It went to my lower lumbar fire, my lumbar fire, and because it been ricocheted, it stopped the hardness of the bone stopped it into the middle of my lumbar fire, which stayed there until it got infected. Then they had to take out the bullet and my lumbar fire. So they told me then I wouldn't be able to walk or run. Well, they lied about the walking because I was walking from 1994 to about three years ago. The running, I hadn't, before that, in 1993, I had run the marathon, but I haven't done that since. Get out. It's, so again, you, you're Stan, Stan Winters, I think was the last name of the character you played on Martin. You, this dude clearly knew who you was. He had to know. Do, do you think it was just you embarrassing him that made him pull this trigger? Because it couldn't have been. I can't trigger. get into the guy's mind. All I know is when I turned around, the gun was pointing at me. I was going to decide. I turned around, ready. Look, although I knew I probably lose the fight, but I turned around, I saw he's bigger than me. I was, yeah, I was going to side kick him again. Hey, let's get into it. When I turned around, he had a gun. Which I didn't know. Had I had known he had a gun from the first, I wouldn't have moved at all. But the fact that he shot so quick means that I was told later on by the cops that the people on the street said the gun was had one arm like here holding me tight, the left arm, and the other arm had the gun to my rib. So had he shot me then, I wouldn't be talking to you right now. So he's ready to shoot. He's ready to shoot. Wow. Okay. It's something else that I heard, and I, and I guess I'm just going to ask you straight straight up. I know the character, uh, Stan, was written off the show. Uh, I, I want to believe one of the last scenes, if not the last scene, that you were in, in Martin, it was, it was actually filmed in the hospital. Yeah. Were you essentially fired from that show? Wow. Yeah, now look, hospital. you and I've talked before about this, okay? So I don't want to go into that. I don't care. You know, I've talked about it enough. Yeah. I show I show as far as enough to show. Yeah. I have no idea what What's up guys? Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move, and I'll catch you all on the next video.